Hey guys, it's Pokemon Bri hopping in here again. I love opening up new product and this went live yesterday on Amazon. These uh, Paradox Power EX boxes. Put it up here so you guys can see it better. It's actually um, a double-sided box. It has a, a Coridon side as well as the uh, Maridon. And it's kind of similar to what those, uh, the Dragon V-Star Power box, I think it was that Target had. That was like $70. Um, that was a really cool looking box. But this... It's half the price they're 32 bucks so it looks like it contains it well it doesn't look like i can see down here it has a uh, five packs it has one jumbo and two promo cards so we're going to run through and we're going to open up two of these so for today's giveaway we're going to include the um basically the uh the the two promos and the jumbo and then a pack from um we'll just uh, do something from scarlet violet era so i'm gonna have two giveaways for that so all you have to do to enter the giveaway is make sure you're a subscriber, hit the like button, let me know in the comments down below what your favorite poll is from today's video. So we are just gonna, there's, I never have an easy way to open these, so that's how I do them. It's not pretty, but it works. This is actually, um, I, I really like this packaging. I like how they tone down a lot of the packaging. It's no longer those huge, huge boxes. There's not so much waste involved and everything is just in here great. They even, you know, with um, having a double-sided box, you're saving all that, too. So there's not as much waste involved. Huge plus. And this is, this is put together pretty nice. Pretty nice. Um, what do we got here? What is the easiest way to open these? Oh, there we go. Oh, so this is actually a full, kind of like a clamshell type. So here is one of the promo cards for the giveaway. It is this Jumbo Cycles R EX. So we're gonna have that. Here are the two of the packs. We have Obsidian Flame and Scarlet Violet. And there is a additional promo. And what do we got over on the side then? So these all appear to be Scarlet Violet. Astral Radiance, okay. A, whoa, a little caught off guard by that. So no Paradox Rift, no uh, Paldea. They brought back Astral Radiance just when I I did that video um, not too long ago. And they maybe it was the, the Charizard tin that they put out. And I really thought that was like we were just done with seeing Sword and Shield all together. There's the code card, guys. Since they didn't have anything in there that was Sword and Shield, but... I guess they're still pushing some of it out. All right, so I didn't want to bore you guys by watching me struggle opening up another one of those boxes, so I just opened it up here. Here's the other code card for it um, for Paradox Powers EX Special Collection. This is actually the pack spread that you end up with two boxes. So we got four Astral Radiance, four Obsidian Flame, and two Scarlet Violet. So we're just going to run through these, um, I guess, oldest to newest. This is, uh, I was a little surprised to see this. I, I didn't expect a, a new set to, like, a, a collection box to come out that wasn't, like, Paradox Rift or, you know, possibly even 151 related. So this was a nice little surprise. It had a pretty decent price point. I mean, you got, what, two, three, five packs there. So five packs, that's, eh, like, $6 plus the promos. You know, not too shat. I mean, the Astro Radiance is a nice little surprise. And we start out with the Decidueye. Now, I still have never pulled the uh, the Sweet Machamp card that's out of Astral Radiance. And then there's this uh, Starmie card. Uh, it's like a trainer gallery. So that would be a very, very fun thing to go and have here. Let's see if we can uh, get some luck here. Glam Meow. Chat Tot. Cricket Tot. Astral Radiance. Set that we really haven't opened up too much. I will say, based upon the uh, the feedback, a lot of people like the Champion's Path. So, there was also, um, I, I think I'm opening up a little more where I'm going to be opening up some, you know, not so common ETBs or product like that. Not Nothing like that crazy expensive stuff because um honestly i what i have i don't have much of it and it's not 
It's more of the like, collection items at this point. But that was a, uh, it was a lot of fun opening that. I really enjoyed it. Felt good. Um, <laughs> we definitely didn't get one of the Charizards we were looking for, but uh, I definitely got to find out what was inside one of those Champion Path ETBs I've been holding on to. So we got the Growlithe, Rufflet, Ponita, Heavy Ball. So we got one pull out of that um, four packs there of Astral. On to Scarlet Violet Base. Not a not a fan favorite. All the like base sets, like a Sword and Shield base, Sun and Moon base, they I don't know what it is. But you think that it would just like linger and be like, wow, that is an awesome set. But I think the what killed Scarlet Violet is the pull rates. And that's what I mean by the pull rate. So we pulled the uh, Full Art Professor's Research. Not knocking it. It's a great card. Great card. But they're just... Um, it seems like they're they're so common in what, in what you can actually get from it. So... Which is probably why when you... Um, so I went into Target uh, yesterday, right? No, day before yesterday. I had to think about that. And they were still stocked full of, like, um, Paradox Rift, uh, Scarlet Violet, like, Pokemon collection boxes. I was blown away by that because the rest of the toy section, empty. Just empty. So, it's... For room, you are not a Pokemon. Now I'm all... Just had to hop in there, didn't he? Which is cool, because that means that everyone has a chance to get the product, but um, I kind of feel like the, the pull rates have something to do with that. So, I I like the heavy chase cards. I mean, if you have, like, the whole entire set, you know, decent pull rates on it, but, like, leave, like, one card that's out there. Even, the, like, the Miriam from Scarlet Violet, I think it's down to, like, 30 bucks for the card. Still not a Pokemon. Cloud Sire. Lechonk to a Scissor. So, again, this was um, 32 bucks on Amazon. They just dropped yesterday. I looked before I did this video today. And they are still live. So, I know I'm a big uh, um, skeptic on telling people to order stuff off Amazon. But since this is a new product and it just launched... I, I had a feeling I wasn't going to get something that was already opened. There's been many times I've opened up boxes that, uh, or tins or ETBs that I ordered from Amazon. And they're just, somebody opened them up, took out all the poles, shoved everything back inside, and returned it. And then Amazon's like, hey, let's just resell it, because this person obviously isn't going to want to open packs. So, I don't like supporting Amazon for buying cards. I don't. I think I think it's a terrible idea. And I've just had a lot of bad luck. I've done some videos, some shorts on it before. So that's the end of my little rant there. But we got my boy, Toka Damaru there. <laughs> Lechonk, Cloudsire, Treviant, Zigzagoon, back to back, Scissor. So we have uh, two packs left from Obsidian Flame. It would be something if we, uh, we pulled that Charizard. We didn't pull him yesterday. Still don't have the one from Obsidian Flame either. So. Maybe we get them here. Spoink, Tynamo, Surskit, Lunatone, Lycanroc, uh, Umbreon. This is, uh, they have some um, promo cards where it has, like, I think GameStop has them. Really cool. This would have been a nice, like, hollow or even a full art card. Pupitar into a Palafin. We are just striking out on this. And this is our last pack here of Obsidian Flame. So... We have that giveaway again for, um, we'll have two of them today. This is a, each one will include the jumbo card, both of the promos, and a pack from the Sword and Shield era. Just make sure you're a subscriber, hit the like button, let me know in the comments down below what your favorite poll is from today's video. Mawwow, Bear Attic, Charmeleon, Snubble. All right, we got Toga tomorrow here. Is he going to bring us some luck? No, another Palafin. So we um we 
we didn't fully strike out, but we definitely didn't hit a home run there. But anyway, guys, I love finding new product. I definitely um, pick it up and share it with you guys as soon as it comes out. So if you guys enjoyed this, let me know down in the comments, and I'll see you next time.